Alright, alright. Yes! Here we are. Hey everybody, thanks for coming to Woodbury Brewing Company. Give a hand for yourselves for showing up at Open Mic. Best place in the world. I'm Johnny Chapman, I'm your host of the Open Mic Night. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to ask me. Everybody gets three songs or 15 minutes or whatever you want to do, just don't go too long. We're going to start the night off with the poetry of Maya Rose. Clap your hands for Maya Rose, everybody. Hello, everybody. How are you? You want farewell in the storm? Yeah, you good. You're here. Glad. Woohoo! <laughs> All right, so today I'm going to do a little something different. I'm going to like bring some sophistication to the house. And I usually do my poetry and my spoken word, but today I'm going to do Shakespeare because I'm in that kind of mood. <laughs> I'm a little cheat sheet here. So I'll do two, I'll do one monologue and one uh, sonic, sonic 60. If you know it, you can uh, mouth along like I'm a rock star. And um, I'm gonna dedicate this to all of the artists who feel like giving up some time. Time hath, my lord. A wallet at his back when he puts alms of oblivion. A great sized monster of ingratitude. Those scraps are good deeds past, which are devoured as fast as they are made, forgot as soon as done. Perseverance, dear my lord, keeps honor bright. To have done is to hang quite out of fashion, like a rusty mail in monumental mockery. Take the instant way, for honor travels in a strait so narrow where one but goes abreast. Keep then the path, for emulation has a thousand sons that one by one pursue. If you give way or hedge aside from the direct forthright, like to an entered tide, they all rush by and leave you hindmost. Or, like a gallant horse fallen in first rank, lie there for pavement to the abject rear or run and trampled on. Then what they do in presence, though less than yours of past, must or top yours. For time is like a fashionable host that slightly shakes your parting guest by the hand and with his arms outstretched as he would fly, grasped in the comer, welcome ever smiles and farewell goes out sighing. Oh, let not virtue seek remuneration for the thing it was, for beauty, wit, high birth, vigor of bone, dessert in service. Love, friendship, charity are subjects all to envious and calumniating time. One touch of nature makes the whole world kin that all with one consent praise newborn gods, though they are made and molded of things past and give to dust that is a little guilt. More law than guilt or dusted. The present eye praises the present object. Then marvel not thou great and complete man when all the Greeks begin to worship Ajax. Since things in motion sooner catch the eye than what not stirs. The cry went once on thee, and still it might. And yet it may again, if thou would not entomb thyself alive, in case thy reputation in thy tent, whose glorious deeds but of these fields of late made emulous missions amongst the gods themselves and drave great Mars to faction. So time for a little sonnet. Sonnet 60. Like as the waves make towards the pebbled shore, so do our minutes hasten to their end. Each changing place with that which goes before, in sequent toil or forwards do contend. Nativity once in the main of light crawls to maturity, wherewith being crowned crooked eclipses against his glory fight. And time that gave doth now his gift confound. Time doth transfix the floors and on youth and delve the parallels in beauty's brow, feeds on the rarities of nature's truth, where nothing stands before scythe to mow. And yet to times and hopes my verse shall stand, praise 
praising thy worth despite his cruel hand. Thank you very much, everybody. I, my name is Maya Rose. Find me on YouTube, Maya Rose Spoken Word. Thank you.